Dad, I don't know. You hesitated there. Either stop or go. Actually kind of brought me back to when you were teaching me how to drive back in my uh, teenage years. Buddy, you gotta either go or don't go. Don't just stop in the middle of the intersection. Yeah, but you and know remember what? to stop at but, all stop but you signs. Know, but you know, there, there's, 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 one, there's one difference, though, buddy. Is that all of your fellow people when you were driving weren't spitting firebombs at you? Yes, but they can be quite rude and aggressive on the road. You know, I would come across that one cranky dude with a baseball bat in his, claw, in his car. Then he's throwing the baseball bat at me and. It's just, I could get injured. That just sounds like a hazard to my health. Some dude is like, rah, rah, I drive up here. Some big dude who drives a Prius and he's just like, what are you why weren't you? What are you talking about? I'm sitting here getting <laughs> stabbed and you're talking oh, yeah, about Priuses? <laughs> huh? Priuses. Yes, Priuses. Because it's such a mean vehicle. It's Such like the one car vehicle. a lot of stand-up comedians just make fun of. It's just like, yeah, yeah I, I was, drive a I, Prius. I was going to say, if you're going to talk about a car, at least talk about a real car. Like, uh, like a Mustang convertible? All right, what, what's the car from that 70s show that... Oh. Damn it, what's... It's the chick with... It's, it's a... Yeah, just, just take a drink now, take a drink. Or you could get an ear scratch. And that sliced up right up your earlobe. They still believe you can do it, by the way. <laughs> you talking the to the gang? You talking yeah, to the, the gang. gang? Yeah, the hamster oh. is still... I see the hamster is still having a drink. All right, problem. so give me some hope here. If I get past these second fucking wave of things and... Uh, Cause I, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm. There's I'm only to... three bridges of guillotines you have to cross, and then you get to the, like the top of the fortress, and it's kind of maze-like at the top. But I'll guide you once. You... And there's, a, there is a like a like a check mark up on fire once we get to that point in Sen's fortress. Well, why isn't? Where are they? Oh, there they are. You're only aggroing the first one because you're not going far enough into the room. You have to go a bit deeper in, like about halfway past the pillars, to okay. aggro the second guy. Yeah, see how he just kind of sits there until you get closer? He is a snake. You're fighting the snakes. Giant snake, humanoid. They got the lay. I said, I was, I was gonna say nets, but that's technically like. Snakes don't. Do they even really technically have nets? They're just kind of like. It's like this big old. Two that slithers. Alright, good job, Dad. Now? And Oh, you shit. don't, don't roll. Please don't roll. You're, t you, in, when you're on narrow bridges, rolling is a very risky maneuver okay. if you don't fully understand what you're trying to accomplish. Which I obviously don't. Oh, did you double tap the B button again? On accident? I was, I was trying to roll. I was trying to roll. I was trying you to were roll trying to roll, things, okay. Because yes. I keep getting hit by that chick. Right. Uh, then you got delayed inputs. Okay. After the fact. Alright. Right in the ass. I'm pretty sure two of those went right into his butthole. So, good job, Dad. That's some, that's some precision. No, I'm thinking these snake dudes. You think they ever like 
try to preemptively like shed their own skin so they would look more attractive to their uh, female counterparts when they're trying to score a hot date. It's like, man, it's it's shedding season again. Just go. So Samantha will give me a chance. Okay. You know you can immediately let go of the right trigger and tap it again to do a follow-up overhand slam onto prone to enemies. Did not know that. You've done it before multiple times, but you probably were just button mashing to not realize it. <laughs> okay, go now. Go now. Hold on, I just... I... You're being too hesitant. That's your issue. You just gotta, like... You, you've got more time than you think before the pendulum starts swinging the other way. Okay, well, that's just unfortunate. That's literally a tar pit at the very bottom of the fortress. Which I'm pretty sure you can set on fire if you got, like, fire arrows or a fireball. All right, one more try, and then I'm Which we done. fed to the, to the sock puppet. All right, you want to do one more try, and then we'll just, uh, call it One more for... try, and then if I... I'll... I'll... Yeah, I, I'll, I... How about this? When we get to that second floor, I'll just give you instructions. And then just do... We'll take it step by step. Yeah. Because I'm seeing the way you're truly are going about it. You're, like, really hesitant. Because you have... You have more time than I... Than, than you probably realize. You can clear two of those pendulums easily. All right. All right, I know that now, so let me give that a try. We just give that, let me just, let me just, I'm yep. just. And you got some extra opticals like the lightning bolts come in. You got that one snake dude who got rejected by Sarah. And now he wants to take his anger aggression out on like, I'm like, oh, you know, this this guy thinks he's such a jack because he doesn't shed his skin during shedding season. Well, mister, I'm gonna... Uh, uh. Ma my sword is bigger than yours, and that's why I'm such a stud. All right. Okay, here we go. This is how we're gonna go about this. So, uh, I couldn't really instruct you there because the game footage froze for a minute. One more time? Alright. I'm distracted by the fact that she can hit me a couple of times. I, it's but that's that's my problem, and I feel like I'm getting pushed back when she hits me. You are, and so I'm and so I'm I'm trying to, you know. And also keep in mind when she shows shoots her lightning bolts, she'll take she'll pause for a moment, and then she has to wind up to cast the second one. So it's a lot of it's it's a few things you gotta like keep you gotta time, but you will eventually get it. Well, if I don't get it this time, I will. I will maybe practice it and try to at least get through and, and kill that chick and all that stuff and whatever. So I'm not frustrated. I just I just need to be able to work on it, and I don't right. want to work on it for 20 minutes while people watch me fucking. I would like it to be a little bit more entertaining than than uh, wax on, wax off. The the you know. Yep. See, you even have to roll through that time. Your confidence is growing. Right I'm trigger immediately. Okay. And it works for, for these dudes because they have like a wider hitbox. But smaller now enemies... Now what happens if I hit these things? If I hit this thing, like it doesn't hit me, but if I push into it when it's flat, is that going to hurt, hurt me still? No, 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 no. The, the, those are just decoration. No, you're not. You're, you're the, the, the gauntlets. Oh, yeah. No, no. You can like... You press can against press them. against the flat side of the gauntlet. And then and it, push through it when it... Yeah, you could you could do that. Just make sure you don't hit the blade part when you're trying to push into it. But yeah, you can. I probably should have clarified that because I can see how that. Wait for it. Okay. Yep. See, like now I can I can do yep. this. Yeah, but ah uh, shit. 
Yeah, but if you're going to go through I got it, I got it, but I just, yeah, I just, I just, you know what I've got to do is I've got to, when she, when she shoot, when she shoots, when she shoots, I need to just run into it. Instead of trying to dodge it, I need to just run into it and just take it. Yeah, just that, take that, it, that's I what need, I do. I just need to blow, I just need to, I just need to make sure I don't get hit by them, but okay, I, right. but, okay, one more time, I'm going to get, I'm going to get. All right, one more time. No, I, we'll, we'll get this, don't worry. Well, that's going to be the thumbnail. <laughs> so, like... Maybe if I try saying soft, soothing words, maybe it'll uh, inspire you to cross the bridge. Hope not to die. We're not sticking needles in our eye, we're getting guillotines in our upper thighs. I gotta get a new chair. This chair is a bag of dicks. It, it like, literally, if I lean back and I'm just like, oh! The chair it makes just... you a falsetto child? <laughs> I saw myself as more of a tenor, but yeah, the chair just backs. Now I'm like, now I'm in therapy mode. Well, father, it all started back in the fourth grade when I accidentally spilled liquid candy on the kind of expensive pillow that you bought for me from Ames when that place was in business. <laughs> I remember the department store Ames. God, that was, that was a couple and a half decades ago. Yeah, you, you keep reminiscing there, old timer. <laughs> What? That was like two thirds of my life ago when that place was around, and now it's not. <gasps> you did it, Dad! Oh my God! I can't believe I just did that. Oh. <laughs> I was like, I'm on the edge. I need to roll in, in through the door, and I fucking remember. Oh, I until the death animation completes, it's still blocking your path. It won't start ragdolling until after the game calculates. Okay, all right, all right. I just, I just panicked. I, I, I just, yeah, I just flipped out. I just don't. You don't need to panic. If no, you take I'll, a hit, it, it won't I'll knock you it. off the bridge unless you're like right at the edge of the bridge. I didn't probably didn't go too far enough, far enough on that one. Just get one. He blocked it. What? Oh, that's a bunch of cock. Yeah, dude. My dad's gonna beat you up. Yeah. yeah. Take that. What till my father hears about this? Take oh, that. Daddy, could you beat up the snake man, Daddy? <laughs> I want to squirrel, Papa. Oh, why didn't I get the? I want ninja squirrels, Dad. <laughs> if if I was if I was a rich brat growing up, I eventually would have demanded for ninja squirrels as like a birthday present, like like. That, that would be the kind of, like, if I was male Veruca Salt from Willy Wonka, just be like, Daddy, I want a ninja squirrel, Daddy. <laughs> yeah, beat him up, Dad. I've never once gotten to that sort of whole, my dad can beat up your dad type argument. Well, that's good, because I'm a fucking pussy. Well, because, like, <laughs> when I was... I mean, I had a couple of couple of friends back in uh, in my elementary school or middle school days where it's like, I don't think you could have taken their dads in retrospect. But honestly, we're we're not really, Dad. You're like right in the middle of it. Yep, go, yep, go down this way. On the plus side, you are quite fortunate to be landing on the bridge below instead of the tar pit at the very bottom. Get sticky don't, feet. I don't understand what my fucking mental problem is with this thing. Just go for it a bit more. Yep, there you go. Attack. Stop. Don't move yet. Slowly go forward. There's a pressure plate there. Alright, Hit I the see pressure it. plate, then immediately go to the right. Pressure plate, to, go to the right. Yeah, just to, or, yeah. Just to activate it and just now open the chest, open the chest. I want to see what's inside. What chest? I actually forget. The chest right there. Okay, well, right there, Robin. Dude, it's it's like right in the open. You, do you not see the chest? 
All right, Dad, now get in front of the chest for me. Oh, I, want to show I you thought something. I was supposed to bust it with the thing. No, you press A to open it. That's what the treasure... Okay, I don't care about those. All right, pan your camera around. Pan your... Now stand there. Pan your camera around to the right side, and I want you to look down on the chest. Pan your camera. No, no, pan your camera more to the right. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going, stop. No, no. That's to the left, Robin. Okay, look to the right of the treasure chest at the bottom. Do you see that little chain that's kind of curling? Yes. All right. See how the chain curls in a kind of circular pattern? Right, yes. All right. Every time you come across a treasure chest, always check that chain. If it's curled around in a circular fashion, it's safe to open. But if it's all loose and kind of slithery, like not in a circle, but it's kind of just, just kind of haphazardly, right? Just kind of there. It's a mimic. Attack the chests that don't have, that do not have the curled chain. If they have the wiggle chain, it's a mimic. Don't trust it. You want to kill it. Okay. But if it has like the circular chain, it's a safe chest. You can open it. Okay. All right. Now go through the door right to the right. And we're gonna work at, we're gonna be a bit methodical because there are some traps and stuff we have to take into consideration. Alright. Do okay, I need yeah. to drink here? Do I need full health? No, you don't need full health here. Go ahead and cross the bridge. Now stop. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, there you go. Boulder takes care of him. He's okay. going to come back because it doesn't kill him. Now fight this guy. Alright, turn around. Cross, go, to, go to about the middle of the bridge and then look to that wall on your left. Now pan the camera down. All right, you see that snake that's kind of rusting on it? Right. There is a secret passageway, but we need this snake man to basically attack the wall. So what you're going to do is... Actually, this isn't necessary. It's an unnecessary... Never mind. It's an unnecessary risk. I'll give you the option. We don't have to do this. It is kind of a risk because you might panic and accidentally fall off or he'll kill you because what you're trying to do is bait him to attack the wall, that wall right there, and it'll open a secret passageway. We don't have to do this. This is optional. Do you want to do this or do you just want to I have no continue? idea. You've been talking for 15 minutes and I have no idea what bait him to attack the wall. What do I need to do? Uh, you're not even telling me what I need to do. Okay, so when you engage the snake guy, you're going to have him attack the wall. So basically, let him attack you, but make sure you're up against the wall so you're baiting his attack to, instead of hit you, hit the wall that's behind him. But I need to not be there when he attacks. Yeah, you're baiting him to attack the wall, essentially. So when he that comes wall. to attack me, do I, what, roll forward? Because I'm on a bridge. Do you see where I'm getting here? I would jump down on this bridge, and that's okay. when you would start to tell me, oh, wait, I forgot, you need to be on the other side of him, Dad, you know, or something like that. So, all right, do it this way. Go down, kind of like, like, attack him right bumper once just to get his attention. I, I don't, I don't, I don't even... I'm standing above this. I'm looking down at this guy, all right? Oh, uh, okay, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm skipping I, ahead. You have, I have no fucking clue. You're talking about him ba baiting him to all punch right, a wall. All right, this is what we're going to do. Uh, Go down on the bridge, on the bridge below. Just drop down to the bridge below you. Spin around. Yep. Go up to that guy, attack him once, just once. That's all I'm doing. Yeah, well, attack, okay. After you attack and, him once. Right, and so what happens after we... But first, so I would, <laughs> I would have just, I would have just walked up. I would have just walked up to him, and I would have just hit him, and then I would have gotten. Oh, oh, oh! That's right. I forgot the. Oh wait, a dad, 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 dad. So before that happens, son. All right, here's what we're gonna do. You're gonna attack him once. You're gonna you're gonna press your character's body right against the wall that's behind him, and wait for him to attack you. Have them attack you while you're pressed against the wall. I believe it should clip through your character model and go through the wall and break break the wall. That's what I want you to do. Top How do I get first. on the other side of him? If I hit him, do I just well, wall no, past him? Well, no, just go right... Yeah, try and go past him or go right next to him. You want to be pressed against the wall and have him attack you while you're but pressed against the wall. But he can hit me. Yes, he can hit you. 
Just make sure you're as in the middle of the wall as possible so if he hits you, it doesn't send you flying off the bridge. Okay. Alright, so I'm just gonna go up and hit him. Yep, hit him and then press your character right up against the wall after you hit him once. Now press against the wall, press against the wall. Keep pressing against the wall, like, play, like, yep, yep, do that, run into it. And now the door is open. That's what I wanted you to do. Health check, and then take out the uh, snake, please. Hey! Whoa, well, yeah, it's okay, it's okay. Dad, 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 dad. Remember, patience. Spin around. Lock on. Right, right trigger. Right trigger again. Good job. All right, you did it! You needed the snake to attack the wall, but you have to bait his attacks because he's not just going to attack the wall. It was he's the whole I can get hit. Oh! 